we actually start out with a really nice opening. I actually like the voice actress for Celestia here. It's not bad at all. Uh, it's kind of cheesy in some parts, but it's not bad at all. I really enjoy it. This is supposed to be our main, well, kind of the bull, kind of the bully here, and I don't see it. I get more of a bitch than a bully, which I think is what <laughs> they were not going for. They were going for more of a bully, but I see just a cold, hard bitch. But you know, hey, I can't really say that. No, why is there a kitty mark a fucking leaf? That's more Earth Pony than Pegasus. What the fuck, people? A leaf? Ah. <sighs> And this is Snowdrop, which is our main character, and we're both to feel sorry for her for some reason, even though I don't understand. But maybe we'll get more character development as we go on. Let's find out. You know I had to talk about this scene, the one scene everyone talks about when they bring this up. This teacher lets this student out in the most terrible blizzard of the year, she said, and... I don't know if her mom's out there or if the other, you know, other kids are going to bully her, but they actually say that. But why send her out there if you know she's going to get bullied in the blizzard? What the fuck, teacher? You're the worst teacher of this thing. And it's pretty fucking annoying and probably one of the most hated things about this thing. Unless the other things, I'm just in the minority, it seems like. Who fuck? Um, yeah. And then we have Snowdrop's Snow imaginary friend, which I don't know has a name, but I really like her design. I like her voice, her design's nice. I just, when I first saw her, I thought she was a, you know, a rehash or just a fake, or just a ripped off uh, Minty, but I kind of like her design. It's very cute and her voice is not bad. Props to this voice actor. Props to that voice actress. I don't know the imaginary friend's name, and I kind of forgot about it. Maybe they'll say it in the episode, or epi episode, fan work, whatever the fuck you want to call this. <laughs> you fucking people. And now we bring up this, uh, the impregnatory special little snowflake, you know, thing. I don't know if that's what they were going for here, but it seems like they were, and it is fucking retarded. We're supposed to feel sorry for this character. <laughs> oh, make me laugh some more uh, episode or fan work or uh, whatever the fuck you want to call this this was great <sighs> okay now that I'm done laughing let's keep going okay who does the voice for Snowdrop um, the voice actress does, does have not you know does it do a bad job uh, she does a really good a kid voice and I think she could have done some other things, but Snowdrop wasn't very, like, we're supposed to feel sorry for this character, but we just feel like she's just a, brand, a bland character. And I think it's, this might be the voice actress, because when she's trying to be sad, she just has the same voice. She just uses the same voice throughout. There's not really any sad, there's not really any anger. She's just kind of motionless and just like a robot with that voice. And I think that kind of throws me off, and probably one of my, you know, second worst things about this is it's just the voice actor the voice acting is not bad in this but it's just the snowdrop voice actress does a pretty bad job with emoting her feelings and stuff it's just not good not good at all here we go again wishing upon a twinkle uh that's how they put it just trying like when she heard hearing the stars you can't fucking hear the stars. Not even the most world scientists are having trouble hearing this. I don't even know if they're trying to hear the stars. You can't fucking hear them. It's plasma. If you're super close, maybe, but where you're at, about 5 million miles away, or, you know, somewhere like that, 5 billion, 5 trillion, I don't know, science. Um, but you can't hear it. It's plasma. It's You can see it, and you can feel it, but you can't taste it or hear it. You fucking piece of shit. Okay, I gotta give Snow a drop this. this. The music so in it, the it's not bad. It's actually well produced. Uh, whoever made the music for these does a really good job with them. The music is actually really first nice in these animations. Falling from the sky. It's really so nice and it's very change. subtle and it's kind of enchanting. A lot of people just don't really care about the, you know, everything else. They're the like, oh, the voice acting and everything else. But no one actually really cares about the, the music. 
Like, the voice acting is okay, but the music is actually brilliant. I don't know who does it, but I would actually kind of enjoy listening to the music that and the ponies this animator to uh, does for whoever he gets to do it. Because it's actually Knowing really well enchanting and really nice. If it was actually in a better animation, I would actually enjoy it. But it's in this piece of crap, so I don't really enjoy it as much as I want to. <sighs> Fucking shit. So, her imaginary friend is her mother? Uh, I, do, I don't understand. You're, what? Is that what she interprets her mother to look like? I'm, I'm, my mind is blown. Just play that freaking meme of the, uh, you know, the Matrix meme. The, I'm, my mind is blown. I don't, fuck you, animation. Fuck you. Okay, I give, I also give it props for using a lot of different uh, character models like the a lot of them are actually really well designed and really well interesting Some of them are really cool. Some of them are kind of crappy. Some of them just look like You know random OCs, but some of them actually look really nice and actually I could see someone Making a original character like that, but some of them just seem really out of place in some areas Like I'm gonna use this one from this scene which just looks so out of place in these nice All right, that that one right there just looks so out of place i don't i don't understand uh but yeah all the characters do look really nice and some of the backgrounds stuff used is okay the, the this has some props for using the backgrounds uh and some original art and stuff like that so you gotta get props for that am i the only one that's kind of iffed about princess celestia's hair when she was younger being a kind of bubblegum uh cotton candy pink i don't know i don't actually see that i uh i'm always confused about that if it's that you know because i don't understand uh how it turned from bubble gum to double mint flavored you know gu uh, you know f that kind of style i don't understand how that could turn into that as she aged or like like uh law by for princess did when she banished her sister to the moon it changed but i don't understand how something like that could change your hair by just using the elements because you had to use the elements before on you know I think you had to use you know stuff like that so I I don't understand I don't understand people like this it does look really cute though and super adorable like that but I don't understand it man can someone please shed some light on that please can fuck oh oh okay I got I gotta agree with this guy you made a star you haven't even seen a star you only heard snippets from your mother or your imaginary friend what they look like. And this is what you come up with? That's, I, I seen better drawings from a four-year-old. Even a one-year-old that what a star looks like. What the, what the heck is that thing? It looks like a fucking retarded ninja star. What the fuck? Ah, oh my gosh. Also gotta give Pripe props to you know the animator and the designer because some of the like i said some of the phillies design looks really cute i really I, I kind of like snowdrop's design i don't think the kind of the white and blue like you know kind of works for her hair especially with that you know light blue i think if they kind of changed the color to maybe a darker blue i think it would work really well but just i do like i do like her design and it's kind of cute but like i said the voice for her is just kind of annoying and the voice actors, I already went through this with the other thing, so fuck it. Winter is dumb. I I don't understand the moral here that if something's bad, it should be good. What kind of fucking moral is that? It is a crap moral. I don't even know if that's the moral or not, but if that's what they're going for. It's fucking dumb. If something's bad, it's bad. If something's good, it's good. Wait a minute. Just like this. What the fuck? Um, but yeah, so, like, being real here... I don't understand this moral. It's, it's dumb. They're saying winter should be good. Winter's never bad. Winter's never good. It's just never good at all. You have... Well, the only thing good about winter is snow days. And I'm in college now, so we don't get those. So fucking fuck winter. Fuck you, snowdrop. Fuck you to hell and back. Fucking fuck. How do you go from a retarded... Ninja star to a perfect snowflake. What? And you used like the same snow, the same thing 
multiple times. The myth is that a snowflake is never supposed to look the same. And you did it. You did it. You used the same ones multiple fucking times. What the fuck? Maybe this is just her early design. Like, oh, every snowflake has to be this. Or every... She's a fucking kid. I can understand that, but come on. You're supposed to bring on the myth. Don't use the same design. What the fuck are you doing, people? Ah. Uh, okay, I'm done. And that was my review of Snowdrop. And it has some bad moments. It has some good moments. But I just still don't really enjoy it. The main character is just one note and dumb. The plot is dumb. The story is dumb. The voice acting is so-so. Some of the characters and the music was really good. But I still don't like it. And you can shit on me all you like in the comments. I don't really care. So, hope you guys enjoyed the review. I'm hopefully going to do more of these. And I know it's already coming to the comics, so I'm already going to beat you. Fuck off. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Peace out. Click the video on your left if you want to watch something by me. Click the playlist on your right if you want to watch a playlist. And the video above that is just a random video. And... Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Peace. Retarded Ninja Star.